In December 1997, in the Brazilian capital of Brasilia, representatives from over 50 nations took part in a major international UFO congress. Among them was Alexander Ballandine, a former Soviet cosmonaut who spent six months aboard the Mir space station. In his lecture, Ballandine conceded that he and many other cosmonauts had seen UFOs. We cosmonauts had a golden rule, he said. If you see something strange, keep watching it, because you may never see something like it again. Later, Ballandine shook the assembled audience when he claimed that future anomalous images observed and or recorded in space would be shared between the Russian Space Agency, NASA, and a special forum of UFO researchers. This was an unprecedented announcement, delivered from prepared notes that would have to have been sanctioned by the Russian government, not least because Ballandine was driven to and from the Russian embassy in Brasilia each day in a diplomatic limousine. Over breakfast and with UFO researcher Boris Choronov acting as interpreter, Ballandine assured Graham Bertzel that some UFOs reportedly seen by both American astronauts and Russian cosmonauts were very real. But when Bertzel ventured to suggest that some anomalous things seen in space might be secret Star Wars devices, Ballandine said, of course, we accept this but some of the things seen have nothing to do 